Hello, Nguyen. Good evening. Hello. Hi. Hi. Yes, hello. 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 Hi. Yes, hello. How are you today? Today is my holiday. How are you? Are you happy? Yes. Yes. Oh, how, how was your exam? No, I think not good, not bad. Not... Oh, really happy? You get uh, a higher I... score? No, I think the why the English is high and but the literature and math is not really high. But did you study? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> not totally. Okay, so but you did your best to answer. Yes. Best. Best. Cool. yes, you did your best. Okay, so before we continue to our um, new lesson, okay, let's refresh your mind, okay, about all the lessons that we had last meeting because it is already one week that you, that we will, uh, did not, what is that, did not attend a class, right? So now, what have you remember with our last lesson before? Okay, what have you remember with our last lesson? I don't really remember. You forget already? Sure? No. You forgot? Okay, yeah. just 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 like remember even in uh, small words okay the title of the lesson that you remember what are those okay so that we can proceed also to another lesson okay go what have you remember just think okay i will give you five minutes to think what have you remember with our lesson okay so 9, 12, okay, I will ask your answer, okay? So just think, just remember, what are the lessons that you've learned, okay? I didn't write, I don't remember, I can't remember. You, rem you forgot? Yes. Mm, that is not the reason. You must remember the lesson so that, okay, you will always familiar also the lesson that you've learned here in Pantado, right? Because you paid a money. So many, if you paid, um, if you um, give an effort to pay, okay, so you must also have an effort to learn, okay? Yeah. So just remember that, um, Nguyen, that we need to have an e-port in everything what we do, okay? Do not just think like that you, you just read, you just talk, you just listen, okay, something like that. But the most important is you must put the different words in your mind so that you can familiarize something not just like memorize but you must need to familiarize the words that you must to study also so your lesson is all about um solution intermediate right so we have uh we are already in unit what unit that we had mm unit six already so in the unit six 
we must to learn that. Other we have we learn also the but we learn the technology reading. Okay, you remember that? Okay, so okay, I can. I'm, you remember okay. already the okay. about the technology. Yeah. Yeah. So that is your lesson that you've learned last. And then next, the human body, the vocabulary. Remember that vocabulary, reading and writing, the grammar. Okay, so that is your lesson. So now, what have you learned about technology? Go before we start. Technology is. Okay, is technology very important to you? Yes. Okay, why? We use technology every day. Uh, it's very it's convenient and um, say. very convenient and go. Don't be shy. Oh, I cannot. Why technology is very important? Internet. 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 What? Internet. It's, um, it's important to me now. Okay, so Yuyan, just remember, please practice on speaking, okay? So I, as I said to you, you must to learn okay, the difficult words, okay? Some vocabularies so that you can speak it very well. And then when you speak, just relax, okay? Um, don't think that you got a mistake when you're talking, okay? Because your answer, it depends on your mind, right? Because it depends upon you also on how you express the words. So our question is very easy, okay? This is just like to practice on how to answer if there is someone asking you. Okay, so our question is, we already discussed this kind of lesson, right? So for me, I want to help you so that you can practice also in speaking and then you become a fast speaker or something just like you will grow to speak, okay? To face um, different kind of people, okay, just like this. So our question is, why technology is a very important. So, you must say that technology is a very important as of now because we are already in a new generation. So, as we can see, new generations are, we are all using technology, right? Because we are already in a modern and that is a high tech already, right? So in everything we do, we had a technology. To communicate, we use technology. To write or something something just like if we like to make our work um, finish early, so we use technology, right? So as of now, technology is a very important. Why? Because technology is already our life, right? So that is why People nowadays are very lazy already if they only have to work with their own without the technology because people depends on technology already, okay? So, next questions. So, it's your turn already. I give you an example on how to express your thoughts, okay? Question. 
is computer or laptop very useful in your study? Yes, to me is important. Why? It provide me the information. And, uh, the information and sometimes I can watch um, some lesson on YouTube that will improve my my specific um, subject. Right. Okay, what else? He has some social media where we can interact Uh, and maybe talk with people that come from other country will improve my English skill. Okay. okay, what else? Go, just express. Do not be shy. Uh, can you use computer to entertain myself after the subject. Okay. Why computer is very useful in studying? Because why? As of now, we use, we study online, right? So if we use a mobile phone while studying, we cannot concentrate. Just remember that. So we must use computer, laptops, so that we can focus also, okay? So it is very important to have like that so that we continue to study, okay? And also in the computer, you can find information. Yeah, you can make your homework, yes? You can answer the difficult questions from your teacher through um, finding your answer in the Google or something just like in the um, surfing um, the information on that answer. Like, so in the computer, you can do whatever you want. Okay. If you are very hard working student, you can do it. Okay. Because the other people or the other students don't have a laptop, don't have a computer, right? So they are using only a cell phone. That is why sometimes they cannot pass their project. Why? Because there is no connection like that. There's no budget to use to study. Okay, this is a very big problem. So if you have your own laptop, your computer, so you must to study hard, okay? So that your mom will be happy to you because when you have that computer or something just like, you are very thankful on all that thing. So all you must do is to study hard, listen to your teacher, read books every day, practice more on speaking, so that you can communicate with other people, even though in different languages, because you know already how to speak English. So as we all know, even though we have in different languages, as long as we know on how to speak English, that is our national language, so we can easily understand them, okay? So that's the purpose now why you study online okay that's the purpose why you study online so that you can know how to speak to communicate with other people with other languages right and also you must learn okay some difficult words something just like you will learn vocabulary you will learn grammar because listening reading writing that is a very basic lessons that we had okay 
that is a very basic lesson. But if you will not focus on it also, nothing happens. So you will not learn. Okay? So when you study, you must focus. Okay? And you need to learn. You need to be yourself. Okay? Okay, so now let's start with our lesson. If you are listening to me, so you can really understand what I mean. Why technology is very important. Why computer is very useful to our studying. Okay, so mm. now let's move on. Okay, so I will share my screen again. So that's this is a review. So that you can remember. Okay. Can you see my slide? Yes. Okay, what do you mean by stubborn? Did you remember this? Yes. Okay, this is just like a review. So this is already a review, so you must know the meaning also because we discussed already this and this is a review. So what do you mean by stubborn? Stubborn, is, stubborn person is someone who isn't easily be what they say. So stubborn is determined not to change your opinion or attitude. Okay, stubborn you have a principles, right? Often disapproving. Not, should, not to change the opinion or the attitude. So furious. What do you mean by furious? Right. Right. Furious. Yeah, so very angry. That is furious. Okay. So what do you mean by publicity? Publicity. Something is official. Something not private is. Yes, the attention that is given to somebody, something by newspaper or television. Next, what is that? Author. Author. Do you mean by author? Our. No. Do you know what is author? Owner, owner. There is a person, right, who writes books or the person who wrote a particular book. Okay, reporter. What is the reporter? Oh, my God. Reporter is someone who report new and... Yes. There's someone who collects and reports news or in the television. Okay, so as I said, this is a review. So do you think women have the same rights as men in this country? Mm. What have you remember with your last answer? I do think so because America which country? Okay, because, in your country, just uh, example, your country. Do you think women have the same rights as men in your country? Yeah, yeah. Because Why? Women, Support your answer. Woman in my country, uh, uh, okay. they go to work 
and earn are the same as men and they can they now can do what they cannot in the past like managing a shop a store uh, trading or doing some doing business that they used they would not, they didn't used to be used to do okay what else what is your answer what, what else they mean, nowadays women can share the housework housework to men so they they no longer have um, they no longer have to do housework by this by this themselves. Men now can do housework. Okay. What else? Go. Just find answers. Uh, Express what's in your mind. Go express what is in your thought. So they think women have the same right as men in this country. So in different country, we have different rights also, right? So it depends um, already in the country because men and women are different, okay? They have different rights. But, but in our country, as of now, men and women have the same rights already because as of now, men are too much abusive to women. So that is why the women now have many rights. Most especially when you are married, okay? when you have a family. So every, um, what is that? part of the family have a rights. Rights for the women, rights for the men. So, yes, women have the same right as men as of now. Before, before the women and the men have different rights. But as of now, as a new generation, we have the same already. So, has the situation of women improved or was worsened in the last 20 years? Okay, what do you think? In the last 20 years, before the women have no rights, right? But as of now, there are many rights for the women. So, has the situation of women improved or worsened in the last 20 years? Or they improve in your country? Do you observe that the women improve? Yeah. Yes. How do you sure? Can you explain to me why did you say that the women situation now was improved than before? What is just like, what are the situation before and what are the situation now? Go. So, okay, Nguyen, this is a practice speaking, so please participate, okay? In the past, there was uh, gender the reason where women doesn't women don't have the own right 
they don't uh, they cannot go to school they cannot study they um, people they was only what they no. Uh, they have to do housework, they have to serve men, they have to uh, now they there's no gender dif different, they have the same right and they or can now study and become no less level. Okay, so what are the difference between the men and women before? What have you remembered? What have you remembered? The men and the women before? Uh, only men can, I mean, the boy and men can study. They, uh, they can vote, they can like, do everything that the woman cannot. Yeah, so that's before, right? The girls before or the women before are they must stay at home only prepare foods okay take taking good care of the child they cannot go outside they cannot go to work because they have the priority is for the children right to clean the house right that is only before that is the the women so the women are in Lee in the house okay but the man is at work okay so that's before so what is that so men before are the one who will find a job so that they can support their family, okay? For the foods, for the needs, for the wants of the family. But what happened? As of now, women and men are already finding a job. As we can see, men and women has already a job. Why? Because they both already support their family. So meaning the men already the women already has to right to work, right? Right to support for the family. Okay. So before women cannot do the work with men, but as of now, we can compete already to the men. So women are already this um strong women and they are really competing with the men okay because as of now men are very what they are very lazy to find work to support their family so that is why the women has always a plan to help the family okay that is why um, we can see some women are in the work, in the office, okay? So they are not already staying at home. Okay. So what do you think to be a good journalist? Do you know what is a journalist? Journalist? Yeah. They go around the world and they explore, explore everything. Journalist that is what? 
making a news, giving an information that is a journalist. Okay, so what are the things to be a good journalist? So the first important is you are very creative. Okay, can you please read that? What are the qualities do you think need to be a good journalist? I think intelligent, determined, yes. uh, ideas, and self-confident. Yes, so we have ambitious, cushioned, creative, self-confident, determined, stubborn, and intelligent. Why? that are the qualities for the good journalist. Because it is a very important that you had that kind of qualities. Because first, your ambition is to become a good journalist, right? If you dream about a good journalist, so you must have many good qualities so that you'll become a good journalist, okay? So first of all, as a journalist, that is, you have self-confidence to find information, to say many information in front of many people, right? That is self-confidence, right? So you are always have just like that qualities so that you can express very well on what are those information that you gathered from different people also because you are a journalist so you must be creative also so in writing um some news or some information you must to be creative so also you have to patient patient at all patient. things yes yeah. determine so stubborn this is just you will not change your what your decision and also the best is the intelligent <clears throat> why you must have an intelligent being a good journalist why what do you think because you when you um, why maybe in why is lowering you may Mm. why intelligence is a good qualities to become a good journalist the journalist may have to solve uh so the mystery and why they was exploring uh, why So being a good journalist, we must have to be an intelligent one. Why? Because if you are very intelligent, you know on how to become a creative. You know on how to be efficient, to have self-confidence, to have a stubborn, right? Because if you only know what is a creative or if you have only a qualities for creative being a good journalist, in that case, you are not a good journalist, okay? Because you have many lacking qualities. So it is very important that you must try your best being a good journalist, okay? Because journalist, that is a rescue word. Why? Because you face many um, different people, um, the words, the information, it is a very detailed, the important, and also you must be careful on what you write or on what you will give information to many people. So that's a good journalist. A good journalist must always think the people surrounds and not always think to yourself. Okay, so you are already a broad minded for everything. So you are not selfish, but you must have to be a self 
confidence. Okay? So question. Do you have any question? I don't really have a question. So what is your question? Oh, before we end. I don't have any question at all. Okay, so no question. So what have you understood with our discussion today? We talked about uh, personality, um, about woman right. What else? Adjective um, about human personality. Uh, what else? Okay, don't be shy. Just as I said to you, just express yourself, okay? Because this is just like a practice. It's just like about technology, vocabulary. Is... What else? Mm. Go. Just try. Um, do not be afraid of a mistake. Okay. So you learned today about that is only a discussion or that is only a review. So you learned about um, what is that? Technology, the computer. The good qualities for being a good journalist, okay? Okay, so, ngoyen, before we end, I will tell you, this practice more on speaking, okay? Always practice some vocabulary, okay? You must read books, or you will always read a vocabulary in the Merriam Webster, the dictionary. Okay, you can find it in the Google also. You can find many words that you must learn on it because we have different vocabulary. So as of now, I will give you 10 vocabulary to practice, okay? So please write this. This is just like your homework, okay? Number one, right? Please get your pen or ball pen pencil or something just like paper okay this is a that uh no a vocabulary so i will give you 10 and this is your homework like a sentence no the meaning meaning only the meaning meaning of the vocabulary okay this is a homework Something abundant. Uh, yes. Okay, Just maybe. write this and then find it in the Google or something. Understand this, okay? Okay. Can you please write? The vocabulary because this is can, 10. And screenshot.
Okay, go. I thought it's homework. Yes, this is the homework. Okay. I have to answer it now. Did you screenshot already? Yeah. Okay, so thank you so much for your time today. So no more question. No, I don't have any question. Okay, yeah. so thank you so much. So please don't forget that homework because I will ask you that in the next meeting. Okay, are you okay? Okay, okay goodbye. Thank you so much. Bye.